Next up on our Blue Bonnet list is the biggest book of our Blue Bonnets this year. This is a very thick book. This is called Tristan Strong Punches a Hole in the Sky. Um, I really liked this book. I am a person who really likes um, fairy tales and folk tales. And so this book has some of those characters that you might have heard about or read about in other fairy tales and folk tales woven into this story. And so in this story, there is a boy. Um, his name is Tristan. And um, he is going to spend some time with his grandparents um, during the summer. So um, him and his dad and his grandpa, they, they get along, but they, they don't, they're, they're having like a little triffle, a little trouble right now. His, his dad and his, uh, his grandpa were really good uh, at fighters, boxers is, is the right word I'm looking for. And so um, Tristan tried to follow in their footsteps and he wasn't exactly successful. And so he's going to spend some time at his grandparents' farm and, um, and some interesting things start to happen. Now, I think I should say that uh, he has a friend, uh, Tristan does, whose name was Eddie, who, uh, who had died. And so he's a little mixed up about that, too. And he, he has his friend Eddie's journal that he takes with him. And um, Tristan holds on to that very closely because um, it obviously means a lot to him. But um, I don't want to give the whole thing away, but the adventure starts out by Tristan finding himself in another world. And how he ended up there um, is for you to read the story and find out. But he meets characters that you might know, um, like Briar Rabbit and Tar Baby. Um, and he goes on this big adventure. And so if you like fairy tales or folk tales, and if you like adventure stories, um, check out Tristan Strong.